Welcome to this video on top quality solar panels. On this channel Synergy Files we aim to inspire budding engineers and technicians for a better more sustainable world so please do subscribe to our channel. There are a wide variety of solar panel brands in the market. Some are more popular than the others. Some producers have been in the market for decades. Every year new brands get added to the list. At present, the top 10 manufacturers are producing just over 50% of the PV modules or panel being installed around the world. Here is a list of top 10 PV manufacturers. At number 1, we have Jinko Solar. At number 2, we have Trina Solar. At number 3, we have Canadian Solar. At number 4, we have Hanwha Q-Cells. At number 5, JA Solar. Number 6, GCL. Number 7, First Solar. Number 8, Yingli Green number 9 Tailson and at number 10 we have Risen. Other than First Solar that is based in the US and Canadian Solar that is based in Canada, most of the companies in the list of top producers are based in the Far East, mainly China. This brings us to a question that do the largest producers of solar panels in the world also produce the best quality panels and how do we define the quality of solar panels? Let's address the second question first. The term high quality panels here implies panels whose real life performance matches the most with their own specification sheet. And this really boils down to just two criterion. Number one, do they produce as much as they claim? And number two, do they last as long as they claim? Now there are organizations that gauge the real life performance of panels or modules as they are sometimes called and publish the results regularly. One such organization is Photon Lab which publishes every year reports on the test of modules. Here's the same list of PV manufacturers along with the performance index of their best performing panel. From the results, it is evident that modules from the top 10 manufacturers generally have a high performance index with most of them performing above 91% of their stated values. Note that these performance values are module specific and therefore the model number of the panel is also listed on the site. The same company may produce solar panels that are not as high performing. The lowest performing module on the list was ES180RL by Evergreen Solar which performed only 80.6% against its own specifications. So among the top manufacturers, Hanwha Q-Cells, Jinko Solar and Risen performed extremely well. There are some relatively small manufacturers that are also worth a mention. Their modules perform better than what their specification sheet suggested. They are Sonalis and Sopre Energy. The reason why some panels perform better than the others has to be understood. A solar panel is a collection of components. It comprises of solar cells, bus wires, collecting mesh wires, low iron glass, a plastic substrate, diode and module cable. Some manufacturers have their own R&D capability. This ensures that designs are optimized, each component is performing to the fullest and the integration of these panel components is seamless with little losses between them. Furthermore, these manufacturers maintain a strict control on the supply chain with respect to quality. Whereas low quality module producers generally do not have a R&D center and have less control on the supply chain products. So I hope you found this video useful. If you learned something from it, please do like it. For more such videos, subscribe to the channel. Thank you for your attention.